hey everybody welcome back okay so a couple days ago when you watched our in cab video telling you all about what we're going to be doing this spring and summer uh, i talked about the 1917 mine and that we were going to go on the other side of the hill and see if we can get into the back side of that big collapse that i found when i was in that one last uh spring so for all my new subscribers who haven't seen that episode, that's the one where I dug it out with the hoe to get inside there. Um, I'm going to put a link to that down in the description area. Head on down there, take a look at that video so you can see what I'm talking about. Got back in there, found the 1917 on the wood in carbide. And then as I went further back into the mine, it was a great big collapse. Now, all this time, I believe that it went straight through the mountain and popped out the other side. And that's where we're at right now. I flew over this area with the drone last year and I saw all these workings, but I never walked down here to see if we can get in at it from this direction. Now, when we were coming down the hill today, we saw that there's actually about, like, let's, let's look here, one, two, maybe three levels? Three or four. Three, yeah, they were stabbing about three areas here. So we decided to, we're going to start here at the bottom and then work our way up the side of the hill. Right now, technically, we are at the level of where the 1917 would have been if you were on the on the other side of the hill. So we are at that level right here. Uh, they look pretty bad though, kind of collapsed. What we'll just have to see what we're going to get into. All right, guys, let's let's uh, head on out for another cool explore. Let's do this. Let's do this. All right, let me show you what we've got here. So. You can see right here, we used to have, there probably was a nice adit going off that direction to the left, uh, but it's all collapsed now. But we might be able to get in a little bit higher up. Now we've got one over here. No, that is my hat on the ground there, so don't worry guys, I know where it is. So we've got one over here. Let's see if we can get into it. Oh yeah, oh, oh definitely. Look at here nice okay lights on yep got the lights on we got one laura all right mm. i'll bet no one's been in this thing for a long time well. all righty what are we gonna have So it goes up and stops right there. They put a bunch of gobbing right here with a little shelf. But that is all that it did. It used to go further until it collapsed right there. All right, well at least we checked it out. Okay, turn it back around here. You just don't know until you poke your head into them. That's right. Sometimes it'll be like that, and sometimes it'll be absolutely magnificent. We need to come up with names for uh, climbing out of the portals, Laura. <laughs> like what you just did right there, we'll call that like the, the butterfly technique. <laughs> <laughs> That was the butterfly technique. <laughs> Sometimes you gotta go on your back, we'll call that the backstroke technique. Otherwise the front is the, the butterfly. Yeah, right. Okay, I'm gonna grab my hat here yeah. and then we're gonna go up to the next one. There we go. Okay, let's head up here guys. So that collapse occurred off to our right. This should take us on the, yeah, see? See all this rock? How it all fell down right there? So what I'm standing on right now is where that would have went. Here we are, we're bypassing it. Now, this is what I like to do, Laura. Look down 
You see the ground? Yeah. No footprints. No. Nobody's been in here. You want to go first? I'll go first. Go right ahead. I'll come in behind you there. Flora and I were talking as we were driving up here today. We were like, yeah, wouldn't it be terrible if you got taken out by a prospect? And what we mean by that is we've both been in so many mines. Uh, this one that, goes uh, anywhere. Doesn't go anywhere? Nope. Oh, too bad. We've both been in so many mines, big ones. It'd be terrible to be taken out by a tiny little one that goes in 20 feet and a big boulder hits you on top of the head. And that's the one that takes you out. All right, well, we tried. So now what we're going to do, guys, is uh, we're going to go up the next level and see if we can get into those. And then finally the third level, we'll see what we can see what we can find for you. So we're going to scamper up the hill. We'll see you up there. Okay, there we are up to the next level. Let me show you where we just came from. Kind of pan off this direction. All right, there we are. We know that we're not getting into any of those except for a little ways. Looks like there's a prospect on the side of the hill up there. Those are all um, small ones too. But now here's the one that I've always wanted to look at. I waited a whole year to get back here. We've got a small one down here by the sawhorse, old sawhorse. There's a small one leading there that you would need to dig out. But by the looks of the waste rock pile, that one is also just a prospect but clearly you can see the vein they were going after right there and uh, by the way guys if you didn't know already this these are all copper mines but here's the big one this is the one I'm hoping will go in we just need to get around those old boards see at one time we would have been in the attic right now this is all falling in. And if I remember, there's a door up here, or what's left of it. Yeah, see, here's where the door would have been. Oh, we got access. Nice. There you go. Knock that down for you. Yeah. <laughs> Crumbly. Crumbly, crumbly. And here's where it would have went in. Okay. Okay. This is great. I really hope it goes all the way and meets up with the other one. Well, we will get pinched off by that collapse, but Again, we're so far out here in the middle of nowhere, I bet nobody's been in. No, there's never been a camera in this. Never. All right. Okay. Cool. Okay, pack rat nest. Uh -huh. Oh, here it opens up. I can stand all the way up here. Look at all the blue. Look at the copper. Wow, look at the veins of it. See, guys, that's what they're that's what they're chipping into right there and taking out. And then everything to the left and right of it is waste rock. What'd you find over here? It looks like a little cubby hole, just a little pocket. Yeah, just a little pocket. Just a little pocket, don't go no place? Nope. Oh, bummer. You can go check it out. Yep. Darn it all. Oh, I was hoping for so much more. Look at the look at the vein of Crisco cold off here to the right. Isn't that pretty? Oh. That's it, huh? Oh, I waited a whole year just to see that? Well. Oh, this thing was even in my dreams. Shoot. 
but the deposit is really i mean look at that it's all up and down the walls yeah all over the place okay all right guys well there's more higher up on the hill that's where we're headed next uh, we'll see what we can find for you we'll meet you out there okay here we are let me show you where we're at i'm gonna just kind of pan down this direction look down into the valley so last spring that's where i was right down there so that's where i popped out of the newspaper i'm sorry the architecture mine see that big waste rock pile down there that's where i came out and then higher up on the hill is where i dug the one out with the hoe and went into 1917 and that's the one we were hoping that would cut through the hill but nope it didn't so okay let's look back this direction show you what we've got now later in years these these roads that you're seeing here many of them were bulldozed so that they could bring a drilling platform up here and core drill this entire area i think they did that back in the 40s and we've got one here that was probably the older workings early 1900s let's see what this one does a little bit of ground fall here yeah that's all coming in Ooh, that's some <laughs> that's definitely isn't earthquake worthy Ooh. okay oh look at this one laura that's a dangler right up right i'm the one i'm about ready to go underneath <laughs> don't touch that one that's a dangler oh i see what happened all the gobbing let loose yep that's what they had this was all gobbed up okay let's see here let's see keep going what's it gonna do uh-huh goes up there and that's it stops right there we got ourselves a prospect is all all right turning around here well it's worth looking at though so today is going to be a day of small edits i'm guessing but who knows we might just be surprised by a big one but what we've got in store for you guys coming up oh boy <laughs> So much fun. You're probably asking, what's it gonna be? Well, okay, I'll tell you. You guys remember when I was in the newspaper mine and I found that winds going down, but I was too chicken to uh, go down in there solo. We're going back there and we're gonna do that. We're gonna explore that. And then on another level of the of the uh, newspaper mine yeah i'm all guys i'm all winded today you got to remember i just came from arizona which was only 800 feet above sea level and now i'm at 6,000 feet above sea level so it's going to take me a few weeks to get adjusted that's why i'm having a hard time catching my breath it's not a health issue it's just an adjustment period of exploring at these higher altitudes. Let's look at this one. But anyways, back to what I was talking about. Um, there's a ladder in there that goes up to another level that I completely missed. And I found it when I was editing. And I showed Laura, I said, Look at that. I said, if we get up up that ladder, it'll take us in behind the collapse. And, uh, and I said to her, I said, uh, if we go up that, we should be able to go left and right and we'll be totally in behind the collapse where no one's ever been before. Mm -hmm. That's going to be super cool. Yeah. Okay. We got workings up on the side of this hill. So guys, uh, 
We're gonna go over here, see if this one, we can slide into it. If not, we're gonna go higher on the hill and take a closer look at those. See you over there. All right there, Laura the Explorer. Um, what are you about to do for us here? Well, we got a little something over here and Gly shined his light in there and there's some slat rail. So it looks like it might go somewhere, but it is a, it's a squeezer. It's, it's a, a squeezer. Slider. It's too squeezy for this fat boy. So uh, not, now, now you all know why I brought Laura along for all of my <laughs> remaining adventures. She's gonna do all my light work, <laughs> which means when we come to the squeezers, those are gonna be hers. All right, so we're gonna do a little dig in here and uh, I'm gonna let Laura film this one. Once she gets inside, I'll hand the camera to her and we'll go from there. All right, guys, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, there she goes into the hole kind of gives you an idea of just how skinny this one is that's why we always say if you're claustrophobic uh, and you want to join the channel well need not apply because uh, these are some of the crazy things that we do so once she gets in there i'm gonna uh, hand her the camera as soon as i get my foothold and she's gonna give you guys the grand tour In just a second. Let's see if I can get it to here. That's about as far as I can get it. All right, have fun. All right, I'll okay. be back. Okay. All right. Coming up on this junction right here. Let's see. Get my lights on. Lights are on. All right. So we got this windlass, old windlass right here. I still see the notches. And down below, looks like an incline. Check that out in a minute. First, we're gonna go over to the right. And let's see up here. That's from that, uh, there's a waste rock pile up top. Probably connects with that, and then we'll go here to the right. Let's see, Let's see where this goes. All right, looks like it kind of goes around the corner, and I think it comes to an end. We'll pocket off to the left. Yeah, doesn't go anywhere. Up here, up there. Go anywhere? Nope. It's in their pocket. All right, I'm gonna turn around. All right, head back this way. Let's see. Really loose in here. That part of a dynamite box right there. That's the slat. Don't see anything on it? Above my head, I missed a little pocket up there. See anything? I don't think it really goes anywhere now. Uh, all right, back down and go that way. I'm gonna come back and save this in just a minute. All right, let's go this way. Got some gobbing. I'll pop it up there. And the can. The can right there. And off to the left, more gobbing. And off to the right, we got that sheet metal there. A little pocket up there. Right. Continues on. We still got the uh, the ties left, but otherwise. No rail, so let's see. Going down here. All right, the ceilings are getting kind of low. Let's see. All right, looks like a little pocket goes up there. 
stops. Maybe. Yeah, I don't really go up there. Down this way. Pocket right there. And then it starts to get low. All right, let's see. Oh, yeah, I got a box of some sort. That vein right behind it. I don't see any writing on it. I'm check it out just to make sure. Let's see. No, that's there's nothing on that. Looks like a little pocket up in there. It just disappears. All right, let's head on down here without hitting our head, if possible. Let's see. All right, heading on down. Oh, goes my head once. Little pockets. Yeah. Oh, bored. All right. Keep going. See if we can stay low. Part of an explosive box right there. Blasting cap. All right. Let's see. All right. It keeps going that way. All right. No paint can or. Something. I'm gonna see what that says. Keep my head down. Hit my head too many times. All right, let's see. You got a can here. Let's see. Hmm. Turn down my light for a second. Make any writing on it? No, not really. Paint can maybe. Nothing on the bottom. No. Right. A can right there. All right. Up again. Oh, making a bunch of noise. Right, let's see. So here, got a little pocket in there. Something up there. And it drops down there. All right, let's see what's down there. Give me just a second. I'm get my pack off for a second. Kind of ceiling's still pretty low. Don't need to be hitting hitting my pack on the ceiling. Get down here. Without shaking the camera too much or hitting my head. <laughs> All part of the game. That's why we got helmets on. Cracking your skull without a helmet. All right, got a can right here. Let's see, Schilling's Best. What is that? Maybe if anybody knows, oil can, maybe? It says something on the back. Maybe a coffee can. You can guys can make that out. Let's see, turn my camera light down. What's that say? Now using and a court returns your money. If you do find any fault, you do. Your grocer return something. All right, a little can right there. So there it is. All right, this might be the end of it. Yeah, it kind of ends down there. All right, I turn it around. Scoop back up here. See if there's anything that I missed on the way. Let's see. All right. As you guys can tell, it's pretty steep right here. All right, let me stand up for just a second. These low mines definitely hurt your back. Only 5'8", but it's a, it's a small one. All right, I'm going back up here. Grab my pack and then head back that way from where we came. Check out that, uh, that spot where the where the windlass was. My pack on. All right. Okay. All right. Here we go. Let's see if we missed anything on the way over here. Let's see. Low bridge again. I don't love those.
how low the ceiling is. as much as crawling into the edit though. All right, let's see. I stand up here for a minute. Get my breath after bending over so much. Definitely low ceiling. All right, back the way we came. Keep going. All right, keep going down here. second. Oh, feels good. There's a chunk right there kind of held up. Nice little piece right there doing its job. All right. There's some, I mentioned it earlier, sheet metal. It's hard to see from the other way. All right. Keep on going. Hey, like I said this doesn't go anywhere. Just a pocket. Back to that main junction area. And I said, here's the other side of the uh, that windlass. Some writing on it, DW. I'm guessing it means down. Because <laughs> it does go down. All right, give me just a minute. I get a sip of water. We'll go down there and check that out. A second, I set the camera right there. See if you guys can get a. I'll be back in a second. All right, I'll leave my pack up here and go down and check out this winds. Well, it's not really a winds. It's more of an incline. Still got strap rail on it, so they went somewhere. But it's it's steep, but it's doable. Just gonna take it take it slow. Mind my head because it's very very low. Let's see where this goes. Let's see. Keep on going. Low bridge. Alright, got another can. Can right there. Right, let's see. Let's see anything? Let's see. No. Nope. Okay. Then you down to the left. Got a little pocket. That's it. Back to the right. Continuing down. All right, let's go. We're gobbing up ahead, I see. Another little pocket off to the left over there. And then keeps going down. Right, let's see. Lights on right. Wood. Let's see. It's kind of steep. And stand up for a second. Oh, that's always a plus. Especially in these lower mines. Alright, let's see. We have down here. Slip inside. Keeps going that way. Also goes off to the right a little bit. Let's see where that goes. Give me just a second. See anything on the floor? Yeah, part of a dynamite box. Let's see. Looks like it's uh, turned on the lights. And it looks like it's a giant. Yeah, giant powder company. Yeah. Oh, here. There's more of it. 40% strength. So, off to the right. So turn my lights back up. I head over here for a second. Oh, lots of copper. Yeah. Oh, look at that. that vein up there. Yeah. All right. Go back. Turn around. Right. Go back over here towards the. Uh, Second windlass, right there. 
right there look at all that gobbing the tilden it's pretty cool yeah all that in there there's another windlass dw continues down i guess that means that's what we got to do is continue down well it's only part of a windlass where the other side went <laughs> all right let's look them back up where we came from Go. Let's go down. Go down a little bit further, huh? See where this goes? All right. Just be real careful. All right. And hold on to the rail a bit. All right. I don't see any footsteps. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Slip and slide. All right. Shore it up over here. All right. Going down. Might end down here. Find out in a second. Yeah, that's the end of it. Don't go any further. Make sure. Yeah, it's the bottom of it. All right, well, I'm gonna turn around. Don't see anything else down here? No. Turn around and scoop my butt out of here. That's looking back up where I came from. Huh? All right, head back up and uh, we'll meet you guys outside. All right, good job, Laura. High five. Not bad at all. Yep, I'm gonna have her do more of that uh, this uh, this spring and summer. I want to get her involved. I, I just I just don't want you to kind of like be along for the ride. I want you to be a part of the whole thing, you know, the, the filming and, and everything that goes with the channel. That's going to be a lot of fun for not for you to learn and experience and uh and then eventually we're going to get you all set up with uh, a shoulder cam and a lot of other really cool things as we go along and get further into this summer but guys that's going to have to do it for this weekend's episode uh it's too bad that the 1917 mine didn't punch through the hill like i was hoping it would but hey we found a big one over here and i i mean I, I would never have guessed it would have been as, as, as much as you found in there. That's pretty darn cool. But we're not done. Uh, we're, today it's done for you, but not for us. So right now, we're going to hop back into Old Bob, drive down the hill. we got more down there to explore. We've got, oh my gosh, they're just all over over here. We're going to hit a bunch of them. We're just going to keep on going, guys. So um, uh, 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 stay tuned because you're going to see all of that uh this coming wednesday or next week wednesday okay and then for the next saturday episode that's when i'm going to take you guys back into the newspaper mine and we're going to explore that winds and we're going to explore that ladder going up into the hidden level um but between now and then we're just going to keep diving into these smaller ones all through here and you'll get to see more of that like i said this coming wednesday all right guys thank you so much for coming along that was fun i hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you all again next weekend. Okay, take care everybody. Bye-bye.